I'm here post game after a 93-84 victory for Nichols men's basketball in the CCC semifinals uh, over Wentworth this afternoon at the Nichols Athletic Center. Um, I'm here with head coach Brock Erickson and student athletes Matt Electus and Jakai Dotton. First coach, uh, just your overall thoughts on the game. Yeah, anytime you know you're in the semifinals of the conference tournament, it's going to be a war, and uh, we knew that going in. So um, we did a great job of getting the pace where we wanted it to in, to in the first half, and then in the second half. Um, we made all the great right plays down the stretch. We missed a couple layups that we normally don't miss, but but we locked up defensively towards the end and found a way to win. And it was, it's all a credit to our players. I mean, these these two guys have been with me for two years. They know how hard it is to to win these games. And um, our newcomers that that played a lot of minutes tonight: Ty Rucker, Quincy Faraby, uh, Shea Doherty. Um, we're all and uh, Nate Duckworth. We're all incredible tonight. So it's just it's all our players. For these two to your left, um, yeah. you know, second huge second halves for both of them. <coughs> uh, Jakai Dotton himself with 16 points in the second half. Uh, Matt Electus came alive as well in the second half with 13 and 10. Uh, what can you say about these two in their leadership um, through the game today and through the season? Yeah, I mean, their leadership has been unbelievable, and they've done a really good job of, um, you know, integrating our other players into our system and um, really figuring out how to play unselfish and play together. And then also on the defensive end, you know, Matt's. Um, you know, led the league in defensive rebounding. He leads the league in blocks, and Jakai's defense has steadily improved um, every game, especially here down the stretch. Jakai's been great defensively, and um, that's that's what we've been hanging our hat on this year is just our defensive intensity and our defense all around. Matt, what were the second half adjustments you guys had to make in the locker room at halftime? Um, I think one, one thing for sure, we just had to play a little bit harder. Um, it's just find different ways to kind of impact the game. Um, sometimes everything won't, won't go your way, but then, you know, Sometimes it just comes down to like who wants it a little bit more. So, thirteen and ten in the second half alone uh, to finish with eighteen and fifteen. Did it feel like thirteen and ten in that second nah, half? Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> it just felt like a lot of running around. But you know, <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, we got the dub, so I didn't feel too tired. So, Jakai, for you uh, in the second half, you came alive as well as I mentioned with sixteen of your twenty-two points. What were you feeling in the second half? Uh, just going off what Coach and Matt said, literally just. But playing harder, you know, making the right plays down the stretch, finding guys, and then ha them guys have it trusting me, you know, to do what, what I do going down in the stretch. So, I mean, that's all credit to my to my teammates and all credit to my coach. They watch film this, that, and there all day just to prepare us for this, these moments just like this. So, just going out there and making sure we go and execute our plan, and everything goes from there. It's really not more, more to it. Coach, Matt, Jakai, congratulations, first of all, on the win moving forward. Uh, Matt, Jakai, you guys, as well as Ty Rucker, were the only players on last year's roster that got to experience a championship. How do you communicate that with the other players on your team and keep them composed in big moments in games such as the one like tonight? Um, I think for me is uh, not not to let the let the moment consume you. You know, kind of like living it. You know, what I'm saying basking. That sometimes it could be sometimes backsides could get tight, palms could get sweaty, but you know. You just got to make sure when you get down there, you know, you just yeah. make sure things happen. So um, try to stay as calm as you can, you know. And once you're in it, um, the more, like, the more play after play, like, it slows down a little bit more. So once you win it, everything will slow down, and then you just got to play from there. I can't say it any more, <clears throat> more per like, perfect than what Matt just said, literally just going out there. I mean, yeah, you're going to be nervous in the first couple minutes of the game. It's, you're in a championship game. You're about to try to win to go to an NCAA tournament. So, But after all of that goes away, you start to go into yourself, and now, now it's really on. You start to play, so you just really live in the moment and keep going from there. Matt, another double double for you tonight: eighteen mm -hmm. points, fifteen rebounds. But I want to talk more about your deep shots, especially in the second half. You mm -hmm. went four for eight from beyond the arc today, especially in clutch moments. How did it feel out there to hit those deep shots? Um, it felt good. I've been uh, kind of struggling lately to kind of make a few shots, um, you know. But I, I, I'm glad that I have like the team that I have around me. Um, like I give a lot of these guys credit. Um, to just kind of pick me up every time I miss a shot, just keep telling me to shoot, keep telling me to get them up. Um, and they always have a confidence in me, so they just keep they keep trying to find me, and they keep giving me my shots, so I just keep going. Um, so it felt good to, to, to see them fall tonight for sure, absolutely. Guys, one more question. You know, How do you get ready going in to play Western New England uh, on Saturday? What's going to be the big force moving forward uh, for Saturday's game? Coach? Yeah, you know, they're obviously um, a great team. We split with them during the year. Um, they're big, strong, physical, and, and really talented. So um, I think the biggest thing for us is just sticking with what we do and what we do well. You know, get out and run, pressure defense, rebound, um, share the ball. You know, we've, we preach all year to try to get 20 assists a game. We actually had 20 assists tonight. And um, when we're playing that way and making shots, we're really hard to guard. So I think, I think that's the biggest key for us is just doing what we do and just do it at a really high level. 
Uh, one last question for me, for, uh, for you guys. Uh, only one lead changed during the entire game. Um, Wentworth started off with the lead, and then you guys took the lead uh, about midway through the first half and just never looked back. Uh, you held the lead for 31 minutes the entire game. How did you stay focused with a lead like that? Um, competitive maturity. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> maturity. I like yeah, 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 I like what did that. you say, Coach? It's something we talk about a lot is competitive maturity is yeah. when you have the lead, you know, you still – you still have to play the right way and play the way that we play. Um, and we kind of just, you know, we play that way every single day in practice. And, um, and our guys, especially these two, do a really good job of keeping us poised and, and giving us the opportunities to make the shots that we're supposed to make, make the plays we're supposed to make, and then still guard the way that we guard. So I think that's the, that was the biggest key for us. Jake Allen will be home court in the championship game, one versus two, as you welcome Western New England in on Saturday. What's your message to the Nichols crowd? Nah, we just got, we're going to really go out there. We're going to play our hardest. You know, it's another game. It's, we got to really go out and, and lock in. Coach going to have the game plan for us, and it's our job to go out there and execute. So, and then we just going to take it from there. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Appreciate you.